Hello, pen pals, and welcome to Amy the Penabler, where we examine all things pen related. Today, I have the Uniball One, and as you'll see in the corner, it's called the Nostalgia Collection, which is a vintage color set. And you'll see that these are a little different than your normal red, blue, green, black, purple. You know, we've got a burgundy, this pale pink, kind of a orange, an aqua, a gold, and some darker green and blue and brown in this set. Now on the back of the package, they do give you names for the colors, but there's no color actually on this printed back of the package. So baked apple, we have here, we have the turquoise, and we have what they're calling a blue black. Okay, so the next three are peach canal, which is this pinkish color, citron, and a brown black. The last two are mandarin orange, and I'm gonna pronounce this the way I read it. It may be off, somebody correct me, Gyokuro. Okay, so I went ahead and swatched the colors so you could see them. Apple, turquoise, blue black, peach, citron, brown black, mandarin, and Gyokuro. Now, these pens are 0.7, so they leave a fairly wide line. They're not going to be uh, minuscule like a 0.38 or even tiny like a 0.5. They will give you some bold lines. And like I said, these are more vintage colors, um, with the exception of maybe the Citron. Uh, some of the others do remind me of vintage colors in other brands. Well, now I have a little added surprise for today, and that's the Uniball 1P. And these are 0.5 millimeter pens. I don't think I've seen them in larger than a 0.5. I may be mistaken. If somebody has seen them, please just leave a comment. Now, there are other colors of these pens, and there are also a there is a 0.38 version of these pens. Now, you will see that these are significantly wider, and they are short pens. Okay, so let's see how this one writes. It's a little different to hold. And actually, these write a little smoother than the last pens. Now, these pens do write smoothly, and there was no smearing on these, and there's no smearing on this one as well. But the Uniball P does seem to write a little more smoothly than the last ones I showed you. Well, thank you for joining me today, and I appreciate the support you continue to show the channel. And we'll see you on the next one. Have a great day.